What's going on my crew? This is Rusty and welcome to another episode of Rusty Builds. In today's episode we are going to be making a abandoned miners quarters uh, and yeah like to talk to you guys about this. So this is going to be probably kind of a new build. Um, and basically what we're going to be doing in this build is we're going to be making uh, the remnants of what would have been a mining quarters for the guys uh, who built this whole thing. Um, so, take a look here, and I've already dug down here, and this actually leads to some sort of caving system. So, um, what we're going to do in the, the, today's episode is get some materials ready, um, start to craft what I th would want in a, um, what my sort of vision is. I am going the wrong way. Hold up. I'm lost in my own caving system. That's how you know it's good. I think I went the completely wrong direction as far as this goes. I think we want to, yeah, go up this way. Um, yeah, so I wanted want to make a um, caving system here um, that kind of connects the dots between the little abandoned mine shaft stuff that we see and this um and just kind of like i said connect the dots but also uh the entire caving system i really want to um sort of make it look like it should really at the end of the day get out of my house is it I can't tell if it's morning or what is going on. Sounds like we just need to wait here for a second. Um, let's eat some bread. Do I hear the traveling merchant? I think I do. I think he was hanging out. Um, I'm going to show you guys in a little bit of uh, what I did off camera um i'm excited to say that i actually did work off camera uh let's see here is there anything that i wanted i'm thinking yeah we needed the wool to make beds um off camera i was doing quite a bit of work uh trying to breed some of these um there we are trying to breed some of these um animals and um yeah so if you guys take a look out here i've done a couple things with the field of roots is kind of what i'm calling it um so in order to get these bees to kind of have some place to go i built this little central flower garden here um and then this beautiful lake uh, pond area uh, So basically the idea that I have behind this is probably want to replace this with a uh, Dirt block so that we they can go grass over to there um, the purpose behind this area here is um, kind of a little known fact about Just agriculture in general. There are some flowers that actually help plants uh to grow um by keeping off pests naturally so when you build like you know a tomato garden or whatever there are some flowers that you can put by it and um it grows the tomatoes a little better so uh that's just a little pet project i've been working on uh sort of off camera um so just a little something yeah there we go i wanted that so the first step uh, in this process is I really wanted to get a ladder um, and see what's down below us uh, and then towards the end of this episode I want to um, just design a 
idea for that mine. So this is going to be counted to me as a separate build um, just because we're building not just this little room. This is the start of it. Um, but we're also going to be building um, an entire mine shaft underneath this complex. So uh, it's a little bit more of a complicated build than you would think. So <clears throat> uh, also uh, on that note, we're going to need to dig out a couple. Come on. I hate it when it does that. Ooh. I want to be careful now. Yeah, there we go. Come on. Oops. So as to not put ourselves in a compromising position, uh, what I'm going to do here is just lower us down a little bit. And I don't have the right things on my hotbar. I need that. So I just wanted to get us a little bit lower here and then build like a little room. There we go. Ooh, isn't that a villager? Yeah, it is. We gotta be careful because of that creeper. Okay. And then we just build that, like that, that, like that. And then when we come down, we gotta take care of that creeper. Okay, good. He's kind of popped away for a second. Uh, so now we got the challenge if this doesn't naturally end up um, leading to the... Oh, no. Oh, God. Mm -hmm. There's no... There was no way. There was no way. <laughs> oh, man. All of that creeper avoiding all of those years. There was no way to prevent that. <sighs> That's okay. Okay. There we go. Now we're back on track. Uh, put this in our hotbar. Okay, so uh, back to business here. Um, so we've got this area here. I just want to do a quick look into this area back here to see if there's any way um, this leads to... There's probably lava behind there. If there's anything, any way that this leads to the abandoned mine shaft, why does this keep happening to me? Oh my god. This is one reason, one big reason why we need our... What in the... Can we not today, please? Three of you. Just my luck, there will be a, a freaking creeper behind me too. All right, just making sure. So many delays on our on our beautiful episode by these guys, and now it sounds like a spider. Got to be careful that we don't accidentally. Oh, he's going after something. All right, take out the spider. Goodbye. Okay. I hear a skeleton. Oh, Lord. There's a creeper there, too. I'm not sure where this is going to end up leading up to, but I want to get back up there. Um, oh, we didn't connect this. I want to get back up to this top area. Because this is the main part of the build. 
So, where, what we need to do now is design what this is going to basically look like. So, we need to have beds up here. Uh, so, that's going to be one thing. We're going to have a couple beds. Um, I want to keep a low ceiling. So, I want this to be like, you know, they dug out an area for the miners here. Um, and we're also going to have in the middle here just to keep things very claustrophobic uh, I want to have some supports like this um, sort of around it so what I was thinking is uh, <clears throat> what we're gonna use is we're gonna use the dark oak for everything just to give it this really sort of underground abandoned feel uh, I wanted to have um, this sort of opening part here but ultimately it's going to be i think what we're going to do here i think now that i'm looking at it and feeling this is um put the supports around this because the idea here is that uh structurally if this there was to be a collapse you want to keep this whole area uh very sturdy so um, and we're gonna basically make an entire uh, the entire floor this this color here uh, but then what I was thinking is we could have a room over here for the for the miners quarters and then a room over here for um, like uh, almost like a break room so there will be chests full of food and then this way would be where the valuables go um, so, uh, that's sort of the design I was thinking of. Whoops, I hit the mic. Um, and I suppose we probably want to make a trap door, which I want to do probably a spruce trap door for that. And we're going to use a spruce door for a lot of these other things that we're going to be uh, mining out, so... Um, but, so here's the, the thing, um, that I'm, I'm thinking about, uh, in regards to how this whole thing ends up being planned out. We need one, two, how do we, I, I really do want this room to be pretty claustrophobic, so I'm thinking, um, what we'll do here is um, I'll convert some of this stuff to stone and we'll actually block off this area here and then what this is gonna look like is it's gonna look like a just a um, to me a very RPG looking room where you walk in here and there's the mine to go down and then three of these rooms and then of course like I said we got this claustrophobic feeling um, as we walk down this area and you're kind of confronted really with um, the choices here but it feels very much like a like a dungeon back in the day um, back in the day of like uh, video games I mean so um, now much like our uh, little area in the other area where we have the lava pool uh, and a diamond kind of hanging out. I do want to leave a few of these uh, minerals and mines that are not mined out just to give the impression of like, okay, this used to be a mine and, you know, maybe they were mining out some of these things. So, uh, but we do need to connect up the, the mines together, and I sort of have an idea of where that is at. I need to re-get the coordinates um, to it. But So once again, um, this area that we're going to dig out, I'm going to dig out off camera, is going to be um, the, the, the sort of break room. This area here is going to be the storage room. Uh, and this area here is going to be the quarters. So we'll have three separate areas and we'll have it be claustrophobic like this. And then we're going to put a trapdoor here and then it's going to be 
um, you go down and you do your whole mining and everything and um, we'll connect to the actual mine shaft and then we'll have to work on the the looks and everything because I don't like the way the regular mine shaft stuff works so we're gonna make something really cool and fantastic out of it um, so I'm excited now on the other side of things next episode I'm very excited uh, we're going to work on building a windmill slash grinding mill. Uh, I think it'll be the perfect tie-in to a decorative item on the ranch to really bring things together. Uh, give it that ranch slash, you know, um, I think those guys are above us. Uh, to give that sort of ranch feel, um, or, or farm feel. Uh, so, and I do want to light up this path and this path here because this is spooky. It's a spooky, spooky night. We'll do something like this, I think. But look at this place. I mean, already I really feel like we have done a lot to really tie in a an area here I mean we've got we've really converted a just flat area here where it's just a field into a working farm um, with a mine and everything and I really feel like we got a lot of cool mystery and and beauty here so uh, uh, basically the idea I think too is we're gonna all of the the items that we need for the uh, windmill and stuff are going to come from um, oh yeah come on come on hit me hit me <laughs> you gonna die Ooh. there you go okay uh, so where's the windmill gonna be I'm thinking uh, I know we talked about a melon mound here but I actually really like this if we mound it up just a little bit more I really like this for uh, the windmill slash grinding stone. So I think we're gonna, I'm gonna mound this up a little more um, and, and make the grinding mill there. And then we're gonna convert, I think, a large majority of this field into this um, wheat. So, but I think that's gonna do it for today's episode, you guys. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, if you liked the video, please leave a like on it. And uh, if you really enjoyed the episode, consider hitting that subscribe button. But until next time, happy mining and crafting. <laughs>